Here are the top four skills that you need if you want to become a highly successful cybersecurity analyst. The cybersecurity analyst role is one of the most popular roles for many newcomers into the industry and it's often the first step for people trying to pivot their career into cybersecurity. Are you confused about some of the skills that are required and do you find that there's often gray areas when trying to pursue the path to entry into cybersecurity? If this is you, definitely keep on watching. Firstly, let's talk about the technical skills. You need to know at least four of these core technical skills if you want to be a successful cybersecurity analyst. First up is networking. Networking is definitely one of the most important skills that you need if you want to become a successful cybersecurity analyst. You need to have a good understanding of how networks work, how the internet works, how data is transferred over networks, and how to protect and secure the information that is flowing across these networks. Next up is operating systems. You need to have a good understanding of how operating systems like Linux, Windows, and Mac OS works. These are highly used by all of the world really and there is an end user computer base to understand as well as a server base so definitely understanding the various operating systems is absolutely critical next up is the various cyber security tools as a cyber security analyst you will need to be able to work with multiple different cybersecurity tools. This can include antivirus software, firewalls, intrusion prevention or detection systems to your SIM, security incident and event management tools, SOARS, security automation, orchestration and response tools, and there is numerous others. So you need to have a good understanding of these tools and these platforms, and you need to know how to use them effectively. And finally, the fourth technical skill that you definitely need is at least one programming or scripting language. Knowing at least one programming language like Python or Java or how to use scripting tools like PowerShell will significantly alleviate the workload that you will have as a cybersecurity analyst. You can efficiently automate your tasks and enhance your daily work and output rate by knowing either a coding language or how to write scripts. Before we continue, just to be absolutely clear, this video does not cover the path to entry. I have an entire video that talks about a cybersecurity analyst from, from zero to hero, basically, um, which I will link down below and you can check it out after this video. For this next section of the video, we're going to move to some of the softer skills that's absolutely critical for you to be successful as a cybersecurity analyst. And first up here, we have analytical skills. For you to be a successful cybersecurity analyst, you need to be really good at analyzing data, analyzing data for potential threats, for abnormal behavior, and the list here goes on. But in essence, you should be able to identify these possible threats in the data that you are analyzing and this information ultimately will result in you making a more informed decision of action that needs to be taken. Next up we have communication skills. You need to have really good communication skills to work as a cybersecurity analyst. You're often going to be required to speak to technical and non-technical stakeholders and you need to be able to communicate a technical message to a non-technical stakeholder just as effectively as communicating to your fellow teammate who would understand your technical lingo perfectly. So communication is absolutely critical for you to really thrive in the role of being a, an analyst. Next up is problem solving skills. Now, as a cybersecurity analyst, you're often going to be faced with these ambiguous type of problems. It doesn't seem like there is always the optimal solution for these. And here is where your problem solving skills really comes in. You need to be able to use your problem solving mindset to really work through complex problems and come up with a solution on how to solve that task or find the best mitigation strategy fast, easily, and effective. Finally is continuous learning. You need to be a lifelong learner to work in cybersecurity and more so to be a cybersecurity analyst. The threats evolve daily and if you don't continuously keep up with the new 
attack techniques, methods, tools to use and technical skills that you need to do the job, then essentially somebody is going to go past you very quickly because you are not learning and developing as fast. Um, so cybersecurity, definitely all about continuous learning. That's absolutely critical. Finally, now that we have discussed all these skills, what are the best ways to obtain some of these skills? First step is, of course, to take online courses. There are a host of platforms where you can obtain online courses, some free, some low cost, some high cost options. These can be websites like Cyberary, Udemy, Coursera, edX, Blue Team Labs, and there, the list just goes on and on. But by going to any of these websites, you can really craft your learning path towards a cybersecurity analyst and obtain some of these core skills that you need in order to start your journey. Next step is to join cybersecurity groups on community platforms or social platforms, business social platforms like LinkedIn. I've written a blog post all about this and I've listed my top groups for professionals or aspiring newcomers into the industry to join and these are really helpful people share great information in there you can really build a community and network and find potential employment on linkedin so i highly recommend joining linkedin groups to help you out with upskilling Number three is actually to take the time to attend cybersecurity conferences. Now, these can be virtual. You learn a ton from attending virtual conferences and it can also be in-person events. In-person events is, of course, going to be much more valuable in terms of building your network and it's really going to help you increase your visibility and connect with physically with like-minded professionals and you'll still learn a lot. However, both of these options are great if you're looking to gain the knowledge that you need to really start your journey. And then finally, practice, practice, practice and practice some more. You can use platforms like Try Hack Me, Hack the Box, Blue Team Labs, Range Force. There's really a host of platforms and I have spoken about this in my cybersecurity analyst video, which is linked down below. You can check it out. But Practicing your skills is probably one of the best ways to ensure that you are ready to succeed as a cybersecurity analyst. All right, friends, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, remember to like and subscribe to my channel for more cybersecurity content. And if you enjoyed this video, you should definitely check out this one where I give you the entire roadmap to become a cybersecurity analyst. Catch you next time. Bye.